This is Franklin Pillsbury from Marine Max here in Fort Myers at Snook Bite Marina today. I want to tell you about a beautiful 415 Monterey that we just listed. This is a great boat, got a black hull, really uh, low hours, well equipped. You'll notice as we walk along the bow, got really nice deck cushions up here on the front storage for our fenders as well as a really really nice hard top that will fill in with the eyes and glass between the hard top and the windscreen as we walk back here to the back of the boat you're going to notice that it has a really nice big swim platform play area fiberglass beach as we call it great storage underneath here for fenders noodles stuff you might be playing with nice big walkway going up into the cockpit and also nice big step area here seeing so step up alongside the deck forward also this seat converts so if we want to add more sun deck space to the back we can move that just like that and add to the sun deck it also will drop all the way down to add more sun deck area in the cockpit here as well nice big seating area for six to eight adults over on the starboard side we've got a wet bar as well as uh, a nice refrigerator great storage space and this boat does have cockpit air conditioning so with the enclosure on you get the benefit of air conditioning here in the cockpit area also got a really nice easy to read dash this has the Ray Marine in the center two air conditioning ducts that will come and give you air here at the helm as well as the Volvo Penta digital controls a remote for our stereo system Lenco Auto Trim Tabs, and this has a chain counter for your anchor. It's kind of a neat feature, so if you know you're in 10 foot of water, you need 30 foot of line out, whatever that might be. Remote control for the spotlight on the front, and yes, this has the IPS, so that means we have a joystick. So if I want to dock sideways, if I want to shoot name to the back, whatever it might be, it's a great intuitive control to show me how to run. Also, these are digital, so there's no cables dragging to the back. Right now I'm sitting down behind the windscreen, got great visibility. If I want to stand up and drive and get above the windscreen, or as we talked about, we can fill in with the eyes and glass. There's a vent here in the hardtop, which is very, very nice if you're out running uh, offshore and you want to get a little extra breeze through here. Super seating area over on the port side for your mates, your friends, whoever you might have hanging out with you, or if they want to lounge and watch the wake behind you. This boat has a nice floor arrangement, the uh, uh, woven material on the floor. Big access to open up for the motor compartment. Really, really super cool boat. Let's go down and check the cabin. So you'll see, very easy to walk down. Nice big companion space going back out onto the deck. Okay, so now we're down here in the beautiful cabin of this uh, 415. And first thing you're going to notice is you've got a big salon area down here. Lots of space to put people, lots of room to stand and enjoy. And also this pulls out and makes a nice double bunk. So that you've got extra space here in the cabin in the salon area to sleep with two more people. Uh, we'll step back in that aft cabin in a minute. Again, it's unique because it has its own head. <clears throat> but right now, check out this master stateroom big nice v-berth full-size v-berth in here you'll also notice there's nice steps so that it's easy to get in and out of the bed also very wide here at the bow and then we have the entertainment center over here on the starboard side really great air conditioning as well as we have two cedar closets one port, one starboard, one uh, for male, one for female. Uh, this one over here actually has a lock on it, which is kind of neat. And then under the bed, another neat feature, you've got drawers down under here as well. Jack and Jill head for this, or door for this head, so that uh, you can access it from the master. Nice vanity area, electric flush head, Huge shower. Again, I'm not quite as tall as Brendan Bailey, but I'm six one and a half, and I've got plenty of room inside this shower, so it is no problem to be in the uh, stand-up shower. Also, a nice big vanity area. 
So as we step aft, you'll see you got a nice big full screen TV with surround sound here in the uh, cockpit area, as well as nice overhead cabinet storage. A little sunlight over here in the corner, as well as here in the center of the boat. Master ship panel, right here, very easy to access. All your uh, pertinent information available right there. Stereo, there's also a remote on the cockpit. Full nice galley. Now one thing you don't find in a lot of boats this size, this does have the standby, or excuse me, the upright side-by-side -side icebox freezer. Really, really nice feature. Stainless steel Cuisinart microwave oven. Once again, great storage in the overhead racks. These are very, very deep. Electric cooktop. Nice window and direct light coming in here in the galley area. Pull out trash receptacle and storage for your Keurig coffee maker. Set of drawers, the lower one does lock. As we step towards the uh, aft cabin, this would be considered a mid berth, but it really is almost a full size aft cabin. You've got twin beds in here that will come together to make one big sleeping area. <clears throat> Once again, there's lots of space down here to uh, sit upright so that you don't have any problem with, uh, with being here on the boat. Got a, another entertainment center down here as well as its own air conditioning unit to keep it nice and cool back here. As I said, a lot of boats this size don't have a full-size uh, guest day head in the back. This one has the shower as well as a second electric flush toilet. So um, again, this 41, this 415 Monterey has some great amenities down here in the cabin. This boat has uh, got a nice wide beam over 12 foot, almost 12 and a half foot wide. And um, like here in the salon, offers lots of nice space to sit down and enjoy. All right, let's go up and check the uh, cockpit area as well as the deck. <laughs>